Hello everybody, it's Tom and Jerry, Jerry Fan 64 here, excuse me. And for the first time ever, I'm going to be doing my entire media haul from July of this month. So yeah, <clears throat> I'm going to be showing all the movies I got in July of this year. And I'm going to be doing this monthly as well. I'm going to be, I'm starting to do this because I know, um, I know Mid-Level Media, I believe, has done it. And I know, uh, Movies and Sue has done it. I'm not trying to copy her, but... I'm gonna show my I'm gonna title this my media haul for July. So let's get this started. So let's start with the haul I got from from uh, Goodwill. I got Harvey, which I haven't seen, but it has James Stewart, so that's why I got it. I got Treasure Planet. Great movie. Blackbeard's Ghost, I haven't seen. Now onto the and here's the other stuff I got from Goodwill. I got Mad Max Fury Road. What a day. What a lovely day. Sorry about that. That's a great movie. Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children, which I haven't seen. A Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood with Tom Hanks. I've heard great things about that one. March of the Penguins, which I don't normally collect documentaries, but I will keep that one. Megamind and Monster vs. Aliens Double Feature. I've seen parts of Megamind, but I don't remember it. Monty Python's The Meaning of Life. I haven't seen it. Sands of Iwo Jima. The Prestige, which I decided to get this one because I'm I'm really I'm probably I'm because this new movie came out, Oppenheimer recently. Rest in peace, David Bowie. The Happening, please don't hate me. I actually am interested in that one. I got Eight Man Out, Rest in Peace, Michael Lerner. I got the the Thomas Crown for the original 1968 version, which I do have to get on VHS. And I have to get the 1999 remake on VHS and DVD. Raging Bull, great movie. The, and the Man in the Iron Mask. So that is it for the stuff I got from Goodwill this month. Now, and I got the, the I got, now let's show the ones I got from my, my sponsor dad and friend Ron got for me for my birthday. We Wizard of Oz, great movie. Focus, which I got the DVD of this one last month. Let's sit on my ear. Witness. Haven't seen it. Independence Day, which is, this is my third copy of this movie, but I will keep all three. Great movie. Oh, yeah. The Adventures of Tom Sawyer, which I haven't seen or heard of. This is The Army. I got, I'm got. i keeping this because it has Ronald Reagan. Spitfire Girl. Where's the music composer James Horner? This one I heard good things about as well. The City Bottom Orchestra. I will keep this out of respect for Glenn Headley, who sadly passed away a couple years ago. And last for the VHS tapes is Schindler's List, which I haven't seen. Now let's show the DVDs I got for my for my, my friend, Foster and friend Ron got for my birthday. Resident Evil Extinction, really underrated sequel. Saw 2, great movie. I can't wait for Saw 10. I got Rachel Getting Married, rest in peace to John from Demi. Heard that movie's good. Stay Alive. I heard terrible things about this movie, but I will keep it for the collection. This is the unrated director cut. I will keep it because it has Frankie Muniz. And plus, it's directed by William Brent Bell. I got The Time, Traveler, Time Traveler's Wife, which I haven't seen. Joker, which is a great movie. Clerks 2. I do have the first Clerks on DVD. My DVD of Clerks, the first Clerks I got from my friend Ron as well. And Clerks 2 is a great movie. Van Helsing, really underrated movie. Underworld underrated movie a really great movie underworld evolution another great sequel underworld rise of the lichens which i haven't seen i hope to get underworld awakening for the underworld awakening and uh underworld blood wars the in, in resident evil movies i hope to get resident evil afterlife retribution the final chapter and uh uh, Welcome to Raccoon City, and I also hope to get um, Resident Evil Death Island, which was released recently, and I hope to get Resident Evil Vendetta on DVD. I got the Fallen Angel 3 movie collection, which includes Legion, Priest, and Gabriel, even though unfortunately the DVD of Legion is missing from this DVD. I hope to get the separate DVD release of Legion. Got Bad Boys 1 and 2. The first Bad Boys is a great movie. I will re-review these movies when uh, the new one comes out. So yeah. I will be reviewing these movies pretty soon. So, yeah. The first Bad Boys is a great movie. And I do also have Bad Boys for Life on Blu-ray. Days and Confused is the flashback edition. I hope to get this one on VHS. I haven't seen that movie. Jason X, very, very fun under 
under oh, underlooked movie. S. Darko, a Diamond Darko Tower. Please don't hate me. I actually want to see this movie, so I decided to keep it. Lampert, with, which starred Woody Harrelson, the late Ned Beatty, rest in peace, the late Anne H, rest in peace, Ben Foster, Ice Cube, Cindy, and Nixon, the Morning Weaver, Robin Wright, and Steve Buscemi, and also stars Robin Wisdom. This is a, my only DVD for Millennium Entertainment. This one I know is on Hulu and Peacock, so I'm planning on watching that movie pretty soon. I got Natural Born Killers. I heard this movie is very controversial, kind of like in A Clockwork Orange. I hope to get A Clockwork Orange on DVD and VHS. This one I heard mixed things about, and I heard it's very controversial. Disney Nature's Earth. I'm interested in that one. How do you know? This was directed by James L. Brooks, and I've seen this movie once. It's a good movie. I got Meet Joe Black, really, really sad movie, sad ending. That's a great movie. I got The Experiment, and we have two more left. I haven't seen The Experiment, but it has Force Whitaker and Adrian Brody. I got, and lastly, I got Ghostbusters 1 and Ghostbusters 2. And it did, it did come with a um, booklet, which I'll show very fast. And I don't think you'll be able to see this, but I hope you will. I'm sorry if you can't be, well, if you're not able to see this. I'm gonna do this quick. See, here it is. I will show the booklet. I didn't show it in my movie update video, but I'm, I'm showing it now. I do have to get the first two Ghostbusters movies on VHS, and I hope to get Ghostbusters Afterlife on Blu-ray or DVD. And I hope to get Ghostbusters Afterlife the sequel. The Ghostbusters Afterlife sequel sa sadly got delayed the next year. But I don't blame them for delaying it because it still hasn't completed filming, I don't think. Unfortunately, Sigourney Weaver is not returning for the new Ghostbusters Afterlife sequel. But I'm glad she returned in the Ghostbusters Afterlife, which is my second favorite Ghostbusters film. I think my ranking of the Ghostbusters films is go Ghostbusters 1, then, then Afterlife, then Ghostbusters 2. I'm trying not to bend this. This is pretty cool. Okay. Almost done with this booklet. And here's the posters it comes with. I, I do have to get a Ghostbusters poster. See, so that is it for my entire media haul for July 2023, in which I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you're generous enough, please consider leaving a like on this video and subscribe, plus it really helps out. And I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye, everybody. Adios.